Welcome to a new video by DJSPRC. Today, what I wanted to show is the SCX24 from Axial. This guy here, uh, this is the Jeep, the Jeep Wrangler, JLUCRC. Uh, it's a 124 scale, uh, all wheel drive, basically a small scale crawler. Now these, are, they're getting extremely popular because they're super fun and you can physically play inside with a small space. Now in the uh, Jeep Wrangler, you do have two colors choices, the white CRC or the yellow CRC, I'm assuming it, it is. Um, today I do have the white one. Let's open the box and see what's inside. Now there is a lot of upgrades on the market for these guys and I do have some in the future videos coming upon us. We have the vehicle itself. Put that aside. <clears throat> We do have a manual for it, batteries, uh, and I think it's a spare, half spare of dry shaft and links, and one spare body pin, because this guy only needs one. And we do have an Allen key that's 0 0.05. And let's see what else do we have. <clears throat> and I'm... Uh, Swearing at you that it's the box that did that. We do have the physical LiPo charger. That's USB and plugs just in the uh, balancing port. One of the things I heard, these are not the greatest. And we have the remote. That takes four batteries. Pop the cover to adjust a couple of things inside for your, your steering or your, um, I think if I remember correctly, it does have like low, medium, high speed on it, but you can adjust your trims and you have your bind and you have your on and off buttons. <clears throat> and that's it, the box is empty. Just looking at face value, it looks like a real nice little Jeep. Um, now I do have one too. This is one of my friends. Uh, mine is being modified right now. And you shall see it soon on future episodes or video, should I say. You do have two lights that come, comes in with the bumper that turns on. The body, you cannot physically remove it up straight. You have to tilt it. It is a cantilever, I think they call that. Uh, it's attached in the back here. Now, when you open it for the first time, you'll be greeted by the battery, the two-in-one speed control and receiver, and your servos right here. Now, it does have a spare auxiliary on it, but the remote, it doesn't have like an auxiliary, auxiliary, I can't even say the word, a spare channel. I don't know why, I don't know why they do that. But you do have a six, no, it's a 450 milliamp battery that comes with it, a two cell. That's this Velcro, we can let it go. It is a 350 2S30C. It's not bad. Uh, what I did on mine, basically, I chopped this connector off. But an XT60, now XT30 on this side here, left it plugged in the speed control, and I was able to put a Gen Ace 800 milliamp in it. <clears throat> 
I played for maybe an hour, an hour and a half with it and still did not see the, the bottom of this, the 800. Now on the 350, I would assume you should be good for at least half hour, if it's not more. You do have the battery tray, you have the antenna, the motors on the side. I think it's on like an 85 turn motor if I remember correctly. I could be wrong here. 88 turn. That's a lot of turns. <laughs> Now, if she wants to focus here, camera wants to be difficult. There you go. It's a little bit better. And like I was saying, there's a, there is a lot of, of uh, hop-ups out there from hot racing. And uh, one of the uh, next videos I'll do is starting to show hop-ups, how to put on these guys here. And I do have a a friend that's working on a set of lights, physical lights on the vehicle itself. Um, once that's ready, I will let you guys know uh, what kind of lights are gonna be and where you can buy these lights. And it's not too heavy. But again, like I was saying, there's a lot of hop-ups with these guys here. You can even change the tires for a set of RC four-wheel drive. Now, I do have, <clears throat> I'll call it this brother here. It's the uh, Chevrolet, I think that's a C10, if I remember correctly. Again, 124 scale, it is a CX24. This one has the RC four-wheel drive bead locks. And yes, there are actually bead locks on these guys here. <clears throat> uh, this guy has already been started to be modified. I just don't want to show it yet. Uh, but yeah, awesome machines. Now, if you guys have any questions or comment, if you want to post them below, I'll be gladly to answer you. And if you didn't subscribe yet, please subscribe. I do appreciate that. And hit that thumbs up if you did like this video. Have a great one.